Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Q&A for you guys. I asked you guys on Instagram and YouTube to ask me some questions for this Q&A for today. So I'm going to go ahead and answer them for you guys. I don't want to take too long because I don't want to like overdo my answers and just talk so much and make this video super long. So I'm going to try to just dig and dive deep and answer as much as questions as I can. Some questions are the same questions, so I'm gonna skip over them, but I do wanna give you guys some shout outs. So I'm gonna say your guys' name and put your little picture right here. And I just wanna say thank you guys so much for asking me these questions and being a part of my YouTube channel and subscribing to me. I really appreciate it and love you all. So I'm gonna go ahead and start. The first question is going to be from jkathy underscore g. Are you still going to be a para or teacher assistant? I remember you mentioned something about working. Uh, yes, I am. Uh, once TJ is in preschool, which will be this year uh, in the next school year, so in August, he'll be in preschool, fingers crossed. I'm gonna put him on the waiting list. I know there's a waiting list, so fingers crossed. I want to go and get my certificate. I can take a state test to get my certificate. And once I do that, I'll be able to work as a paraprofessional in the school district, which I'm super excited about. I do have my uh, medical billing uh, license, but I just, I've never seen myself working in a hospital. I know that's something that my mom really wanted me to do, uh, to, whether it was like a nurse or a medical assistant, I'll be in something like that, but I just never seen myself and I didn't really have the passion for that. Uh, so I finally found a passion and it is kids. Like I, I enjoy being around kids. So I, I want to work in a school. The next question is from Jen underscore one nine eight three five. How long do you think you will continue to do YouTube? Well, that'll follow along with the first question. Once I get a full-time job and have my career set, I will stop doing YouTube. Unfortunately, I just wanna keep my work life separated from social media. I actually, I don't know if you guys have noticed, I'm not on Snapchat anymore. I uh, am trying little by little not to have social media platforms as and be on them as much as I was. So I deactivated my Facebook and I do not have Snapchat no more. And I do have Instagram because I really like Instagram and I'm not on it a whole tons. Like I can control myself from that. And then obviously YouTube. So that's something that I am going to be stopping once I have my job and my career. Do you guys? Oh, the next question is from mommy.eli. These are going to be two questions that she asked. Did you guys start the home buying process and any plans for a baby? So I don't really like um, putting that info out because I feel like you jinx yourself on stuff like that but I can say we are in the beginning process of home buying and then any plans for a baby I I would love to have one right now but we just do not have the space so once we get the space for another addition to our family we will definitely be expanding it the next question is from Katrina Marie 89 do you have green eyes I do have green eyes so let me see if I can get there they are I do have green eyes. I got them from my grandpa. He is my grandpa from Puerto Rico. Uh, if you guys are uh, OG subscribers, you guys will know that I have a grandpa from Puerto Rico and he came down actually in 2018 for six months and he lived here with us. So that's where I get my eyes from. And my older sister actually has green eyes too. My mom had four girls and only two of us came out with green eyes. The next question is from Yvette underscore Cruz underscore XO. Hi, um, what are your holy grail cleaning products of 2018? This is actually, when I seen this question, I was like, ooh, I want to do this a whole separate video. So thank you, Yvette, for that question because this next video after the Q&A is going to be my favorite, um, the holy grail cleaning products of 2018. So thank you for that video idea. Uh, so guys, look out for that video if you guys want to know. The next question is going to be from Candy underscore Sweets. Zero one. How long did it take to get used to waking up at 6 30 a.m.? Um, to be honest, my mom was such an early bird since I was little, and I remember like being 11, 12 years old, waking up like at 5 30 in the morning with my mom every day to help her make my dad's lunch for work. And we would just sit there, she would have her coffee, I would eat oatmeal that she made or sweet rice, and we would just talk. And then I would get ready for school, and it's just been a routine like that since I was little. And then when I had kids, it just, I just continued that cycle. I'm such an early bird that sometimes it's not a good thing because I wish I can sleep in. Like, honestly, I wish I can sleep in. I just can't, my body doesn't function like that. And I'm always up early. All right, so then, uh, 
The next question is from... Ah, where did I leave off? Oh my gosh, I hope I say your name right. I've been trying to pronounce it. Feyre underscore D Garcia. Are you still doing online school and what was your major? I am not doing online school. Uh, from the first question I was saying, I do have my medical billing certificate. I did get that online and that's what I was going to school for. I have answered that question in a previous q and I think, but yeah. So I, I'm not doing online schooling anymore. I finished that and it's for medical billing. And the last question on Instagram is from Melted With Love. Do you miss working? You know, I have had a job from when I was 15 and a half all the way till gonna be 21. And after quitting, I became a stay at home mom full time. And it was one of the hardest things I had to do because I felt like I was always in work mood, waking or work mode, waking up, having to get the kids ready, take them to my mom's and stuff like that. And it just didn't happen. And so when I was going through that, I did go through a depression, a really bad depression. And then I ended up um, just enjoying my time here with the kids. And now I love being a stay at home mom. So I don't really miss it as much as I used to. But I know once I get back into that, work mode I will love it again because there are days where I'm just like oh I wish I was back at work but I mean it's not something that I'm like uh rushing to do I should say so now I'm gonna go on to my YouTube questions and I'm gonna answer the first one from mommy of two does your family watch your YouTube videos and are you planning to move on to a bigger home and have a baby soon maybe uh, my family does watch my YouTube videos. Actually, one of my aunts, hi Thea, she watches my videos and she'll text me saying like, I, I watched your video, I loved it, or like we'll talk in person and stuff like that. And then a couple of other family members watch it as well. And um, hopefully we get a bigger house, praying to God. But for sure you guys will know whenever that happens. I'm just not trying to jinx myself or put it out there. It's one of those things where once I get the keys, y'all will know. And then again, the baby question, once we get a bigger place. The next question is from Mama Kayla XO. My question is, do you plan on moving? See, that's another question that's answered a lot. So I did answer that question already. And then the next question is from Mommy on the go plus two. Hey girl, does your family watch your videos? Um, yeah, they do. That was the other question. So yeah, my family does watch my videos. Uh, at first I thought it was very weird. I didn't want my family watching them at all. And then they kind of just gradually started watching them on their own because they started seeing how much subscribers I was getting. They were like, oh, she's actually doing good at this. Let me see what her videos are about. And then eventually I just got over it and sometimes they'll be like, oh, I liked your video. And then it's not as awkward when they say, oh, I liked your video or stuff like that. But it. It, and like my stomach turns when they tell me like, oh, I seen your video and I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> but yeah, so they do watch my videos. Uh, and then the next question is from Noor Fari from yeah. Pakistan. Oh, you actually comment on a lot of my videos. Hey girl, thanks for subscribing to me and showing me love in every single video. I do see you and I am recognizing your love now. Um, baby number three planning, yes or no? Um... I wouldn't say yes this year, maybe next year. And then the next question and last question, oh no, no, not last question. Uh, Camp Campuzano, Yesenia, hey Yesenia. Um, do you plan on sharing any tips for potty training? Oh, can you guys share tips for me? <laughs> it's very hard to train a boy in my opinion. Uh, maybe a mom of boys can give me some opinions down below, but my son just does not want to potty train and it's very hard to get him to sit on the toilet. I wish he was like Naraya where she just potty trained herself. She was she was more of like a clean freak where she couldn't be peed on her diaper or else it would drive her nuts. So she just potty trained herself. So I don't even have tips on potty training Naraya. But the little gummy worms are helping. Like if I tell him, you want a gummy worm? You have to go pee pee in the toilet. So he'll go and sit right there and then like little droplets will come out. So I find that that's pretty helpful in that sense. But going poop or actually full on learning on his own, I have no tips. I'm just going with the flow. But once he's potty trained, I'm definitely uh, thinking of doing a, a tip, a potty training tip video for little boys because they're pretty hard in my opinion. Uh, the next question is from Restored Beauty 
do you have a lifetime goal? My lifetime goal is, of course, to have a bigger home, to expand my family by maybe one or two more, and to work and be successful on my marriage. Something that's very important to me is my marriage and my husband. So my husband and I always having some quality time, at least if it's like a date once a month, if, if we can't do more than that. But yeah, that's pretty much my lifetime goal is to continue to be a understanding wife and caring mother and to just expand our family as in like housewives, maybe even two more kids, I don't know, but that's pretty much my lifetime goal. And also um, having my career set. I don't want to be a stay at home mom forever. I mean, it's very nice, I love it, it's wonderful. I get to see my kids grow, but I would like to have a career uh, later on in the future. And that is it, the, the couple of questions after are pretty much the same as the job wise thing. But I want to thank you guys so much for asking me these questions and being a part of my YouTube channel and always giving me love and sending me like wonderful comments about me as a person and saying that you love my channel and that I'm very helpful and you like when I give advice. So thank you guys so much. Also in this video on the comments, please leave me some video ideas. I would love to hear your guys ideas, especially like that cleaning one. Thank you so much, um, Yvette, for leaving me that. It was a great video idea. Like, I am out of ideas sometimes, so when you guys leave me requests, it really helps a lot. So, like I said, please leave some down below. If you guys enjoyed this video and got your guys' questions answered, please give it a thumbs up. And uh, also thumbs it up for more Q&As soon. You guys can ask me, like, questions or dares and stuff like that. Um, would you rather stuff like that so I don't know if you guys would like to see that but anyways thank you guys so much and if you are not subscribed to my channel and click the like button and turn on your post notification bell and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys bye you want to say bye come here this is my son if you guys don't know him this is Teej say hi Teej say hi okay say bye Bye. Bye. Say subscribe. Da, da, da. <laughs> <laughs>